if we can help individual residents uh, achieve their own prosperity, uh, then the uh, cities and towns that they live in and the entire Commonwealth will be much stronger. I never thought, A, that I would work for a Republican governor, and B, that I would hear a Republican governor say, we have to worry more about people than, than Wall Street. He understands every facet of state government. He could be the most qualified person, the most well-prepared person uh, to be governor that we've ever had. Republican, Democrat, Libertarian, unenrolled, it doesn't matter. What we're about is good public policy. And the relationship that I've had with the governor and the lieutenant governor has really shown me that uh, this bipartisan thing that we're practicing is really working. Growing up in Chelsea it wasn't always easy. Um, I, I come from a, a background with a, a single parent household, um, homeless at the time. I was uh, very fortunate to be given the opportunity uh, to lead my native Chelsea. Growing up as a kid, people always pointed to Chelsea as the butt end of a joke, uh, making fun of the city and everyone in it. And uh, instead, as I left uh, recently uh, Chelsea, I was so proud uh, to see the people were pointing to Chelsea as a success model. Uh, first and fo foremost is uh, a goal that the governor has, which is to end homelessness. Uh, we want to get uh, the hotel and motel population, uh, families that are homeless and in hotels and motels, um, into secure uh, housing environments. Uh, thoughts around workforce development are, are always with me. Thoughts about uh, how to improve education, um, how to give people opportunities uh, to experience a better quality of life through finding a better job is um, a second goal. And then if we're successful on dealing with homeless, if we're successful in helping people enjoy a better prosperity, uh, the economic development umbrella that I'm working on uh, will be successful as well. My name is Jay Ash, and I'm the Secretary of Housing and Economic Development for the Commonwealth of Massachusetts.